Welcome to Cheap Stuff on Amazon's first three minute unboxing and first impressions. This is an attempt to make available for everyone what they need to know about a new product in just a few minutes. Something you can watch in a short break, a commercial break, or even standing in front of a product in a store. Today I have the Essential Phone that sports an edge to edge screen at 2560 by 1312 QHD. The screen is 5.71 inches from the radius to corners. I have put this up against the iPhone 6S Plus and it is amazing how much space you get in such a small form factor. The rear camera is 13 megapixels and is a dual RGB plus mono camera with image fusion technology and a 13 megapixel true monochrome mode with an f-stop of 1.85. The Essential Phone rear camera has a hybrid autofocus combining contrast, phase detect, and an IR laser for assist focus. This reminds me of the LG G3, and I did like this feature and the quickness of its focus. The camera is capable of 4K video at 30 frames per second, 100, uh, 1080p at 60 frames per second, and 720p at 120 frames per second. The front camera is an 8 megapixel resolution with a 16 by 9 aspect ratio and an f-stop of 2.2 with a fixed hyperfocal lens. The front camera is capable of 4K video at 30 frames per second, 1080p at 60 frames per second, and 720p at 120 frames per second. The battery is 30,040 milliamps and has fast charging via USB with the included charger. I have so far in the first two days of using this with heavy usage got about 12 hours for each charge and was able to charge the battery in under an hour. The charge slash data port on the bottom is USB type C and there is no headphone jack but there is a USB C to 3.5 millimeter headphone jack included. You are also looking at water and dust resistance IP54. It's not waterproof but it protects against splashing. Inside this phone you will find a Qualcomm Snapdragon 835, an octa-core 64-bit 10 nanometer processor and this phone has 4 gigabytes of RAM. This is all protected by a titanium body, a ceramic back, and a Corning Gorilla Glass 5 front. My first impressions so far are good. The phone because of its glass seems to be slippery and has fallen twice. With these falls not a single scratch on the titanium bezel or on the screen. The Android OS seems to be vanilla and is smooth like butter. I will use this phone for a month and then probably report back with a longer and more personalized review of the essential phone. Please click subscribe and click the alerts bell to be notified when this comes out. As always, thank you again for watching Cheap Stuff on Amazon and stay tuned for much more.